A local group is appealing to a major grocery chain to help improve the conditions of farm workers in Florida. The group wants public supermarkets to take part in a fair food campaign. SNN Local News 6 reporter Jessica Jordan has that story. They've gone 18 miles of biking and two letters to deliver to public grocery store managers asking them to participate in a fair food campaign. The coalition believes that the public uh, has a responsibility to step forward and ensure that there's not abuses in their supply chain. The coalition of Immokalee workers represents a group of workers who harvest tomatoes in Florida. They recently embarked on a letter writing campaign to convince public supermarket to help improve the conditions of farm workers in Florida. In December, crew leaders from the Immokalee farming community pled guilty to forcing a dozen men to harvest tomatoes in South Florida. Pacific, one of the farms where the men worked, is a Publix tomato supplier. The coalition has sent two letters to Publix requesting a meeting to talk about abuses in the tomato industry, and Publix hasn't even responded uh, to these letters. The company has released an email response to this issue, stating that, quote, we are confident Governor Christ and Florida's law enforcement agencies will work tirelessly to eradicate slavery and human trafficking from our great state. But this group wants to see changes quickly. That's why they're banding together to personally deliver letters to Sarasota and Longboat Key Public Supermarkets markets and hope some of them will listen to their pleas. We just wanted to share about the farm workers that uh, we're concerned about. The group's visit got the attention of local public shopper Mira Frederick, who jumped in to speak to the store manager when the group visited the first public store. If I were younger and could bike, do all the biking, I do bike but not that much, uh, I would have joined them because I think the uh, for years, the tomato growers have not gotten what they should get. Coalition supporters are asking companies to pay tomato workers an extra penny per pound in hopes to improve their working conditions little by little. Jessica Jordan for SNN Local News 6. The public's corporate office tells us that they don't get involved in disputes between suppliers and their employees. Whole Foods has already signed an agreement with the coalition to help improve the working conditions for growers.